Hi people and I'm back cooking again and today I'm going to be doing my version of veg curry. Right as you can see I've uh, got a bit of cauliflower off. Oh I've not cut it up proper. Um, just need the florets. Right, um, I've cut my uh, cauliflower up. Um, it does actually say on some of, I've seen about two different videos of these and it says you can put the uh, the green in, it adds colour and that. Um, but it says you do have to keep stirring it um, for a while. I have put some... Um, I don't know what you call it. I'll put some vegetable oil in because um, oh, obviously this is a vegetable. Because this is a vegetable um, curry. So I'll just give that a good stir. And then I'm going to add some carrots. That's it, get them all in. Stir them in. I'm going to add some salt and pepper. It says you need to keep adding that, the, the salt and pepper, all through the ingredients. So I'm giving that a good turn over. You can hear it starting to sizzle. Well, I don't know if you can for my camera, but it's starting to sizzle. Right, and I'm going to now add my frozen rock solid peas. To give them time, that's a bit of ice. Let's get that ice out. Get them ready for this. Oh, with the frosting time, mix them round. They've all, uh, they've all start to. There's a few of them have already come apart, not come apart, I mean come away from the... <laughs> I can guarantee that's going to be coming out soon, I'm going to throw that away. Um, it does say, you know, uh, to add the spud taters. Still, I'm going to tuck the pan on my sleeve. Oops. Hey, do you know, actually, on the video, <laughs> That's what happened with <laughs> Now, on the, on, the, on the video I saw, it showed you how to make curry. And I'm not putting all that stuff in, what you put in. So I've got a curry that's already done. Small anyway, but it's 
I might need to do is add some more salt and pepper. I need to turn that in. <laughs> Same happened to him. So I can't. Uh, Thank you for picking that up there. Yeah. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put in the... Uh, oh shit! <laughs> I forgot the honey ons. <laughs> oh dear me! I forgot they were there. Need to get them worked in. It's fun, love, that's sure. Oops, I'm flying out. Oh, yes. Right, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to put the sauce in. Um, I've been doing this on heat number four. You see that? Yeah. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn down. Yeah, there's a number four in there. I'm going to turn that to number three because it does say to cover it and leave it to cook for a while. But I need to add the sauce. salt and pepper away now. I've used it enough as I've been told. So now we're going to make sure everything gets covered in the curry so I can, oh shit it's all falling out. So uh, I can put a lid on it and well yeah as you can see it's all done nicely and done and done <sighs> might as well be, but might be best turning it off wouldn't it at least come to do the taste test Snatch the bowl out of my hand, why don't you? You're not in camera, you need I to am, bend down. Eh? Want to sit on my stove? Mmm. It is a bit, um, what it is? Cuts a bit of crunch up. Tears are probably to a bit longer. Yeah. Because they're not that soft. Well, but they're, they're not, not too hard. I guess they're not supposed to be too soft. But everything else is fine. You can't. Curry's not as strong as it should be, but yeah. Fine. Not as strong as it should be. <laughs> <laughs> right, as Lee said, it's not uh, strong, which means I might be able to have some. So if you like what you see, please keep viewing me. If you want to give me a big old thumbs up, please be, good, be much appreciated. If you want to leave a comment, the more the merrier. And if you haven't subscribed or you know someone who hasn't subscribed, get subscribing, get them subscribing, get everybody subscribing. Thank you. Bye.